And good morning, everybody. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> I have got the air conditioning cranked in the car, so excuse the background noise. It is now. Come on, phone. Come on, phone. Okay, Google. My phone doesn't want to turn on. Had to make a couple quick stops, take care of some things before I got out of town for the moment. I have got to pack a bag and get the hell out of here. So now it's off to Venice Beach to take care of work stuff and then fly out there, fly home as fast as possible. It's probably gonna take a lot longer than what I really want it to. I don't even wanna stop and get gas. I'm probably gonna have to on my way back. I'm running late, these stops have already put me behind. I have had so much trouble with my phone recently, it's not even funny. I cannot afford to have the thing die right now. Time to go. I want coffee, I want a Red Bull, I want Rockstar, I want, ugh, I want something that I don't have time to stop and get. I'm telling you, I am, I am antsy, like I am anxious to finally be on the road, not this road, the road to Salt Lake City, I am totally excited for this trip, I hope we do and see a lot of fun stuff, this is kind of going to be the uh, slow relaxing trip I've been calling it kind of the the precursor to our trip in September that we have coming up this is gonna be the slower paced enjoyable just kind of enjoying five days of not this god that took forever it's almost 3 p.m. Two hours, I'm on the freeway, and guess what? I gotta stop for gas. It's gonna be a two hour drive home. Just wanna be on vacation. I mean, kind of a vacation. I'm calling it a vacation, trying to, to convince myself that that's what it's gonna be, and that's what it should be. As long as I can maintain keeping stress levels low, anxiety out of my way, I think it should be a pretty good trip. I'm excited, hopefully, Everyone is at home ready and excited. Talk to Steven a little bit earlier. He almost got the Durango all loaded up and ready to go. Just stopped for gas. I made it about halfway. I think I'm about the halfway point. Running a tad bit later than I expected, uh, especially having to stop We'll be home in about 45 minutes or so. Ugh. It's one of those days where life wants me to be upset, but it's not gonna happen today, life. Not gonna happen today. And when that light turns green, we're out of here. Come on. Yeah. Now we are gone. I'll see you guys at home. camera bag. I've got hot dogs for the road because I haven't eaten yet. Rockstar, Red Bull, Ooh. and you. Okay, we're officially out of here. Pretty much getting started on the road. I'm not sure. Uh, we're going to have about 10 hours of driving ahead, so I'm not sure what the video is going to consist of from this point, but like, let's have some fun. <laughs> All right, so I thought I was getting, I thought I was getting a Mountain Dew. Here, take that change there before I drop all this shit. I'm just carrying cash around like it ain't shit. Uh, I thought I was getting a Mountain Dew. I ended up getting a Mutant Super Soda. I, I really hope it's a Mountain Dew. Drink Mutant. I mean, it's gonna be interesting. It's yeah. No idea what that. We are 
almost out of like, no, I think we are out of LA County now. It took us forever to get as far as we did. So far, so good. We're about 45 minutes into the drive, which probably should have taken us about 20 minutes. We're gonna get there like really early in the morning. A lot of darkness is coming. As you can see, like the sun's, the sun's kind of up. Maybe you can't see. The sun's kind of up over my shoulder. If I turn it this way, maybe you can see the car. Where is my car? Here, maybe? Can I move it? Yeah, it is. There, maybe. I don't know, I can't see in this display screen, it sucks. But back behind me, there is the 15 freeway. Heads all the way up north, just right outside of Los Angeles, San Bernardino area. And it's gonna take us all the way up to Salt Lake City. That's where we are going. Let's go have some fun. All right, so I'm going to try whatever this is. I was really hoping for a Mountain Dew. I'm, I'm still hopeful that it's Mountain Dew under a different label, but it has a monster symbol to it, which pisses me off. Mutant Super Soda, it's got, got the monster label on it. I grabbed it really quick. It was like a split last second decision. I was like, I'm gonna get a Mountain Dew. And I grabbed this and I didn't read the, the label. Let's try it. Oh, it's totally a Mountain Dew. Yeah? Ted different. Yeah, it's, it's not as sweet. That, it's still a Mountain Dew, but you can taste the monsteriness. Yeah. This. So, uh, I mean, I recommend checking it out. I'm not sad about it, so it gets it a thumbs up. <laughs> It is currently just past 9 p.m. We have officially made it into the state of Nevada, which is gonna be uh, starting California, then we're gonna go through Nevada, then we're gonna go through like a little tip of Arizona into Utah. Can't ask for much more. We saw a beautiful sunset. I'm glad I was able to share that with you guys because it, like, it really looked really, really cool. I'm totally just really stoked that uh, this trip has gone as smooth as, as it's gone so far. No complaints. It's been pretty badass. I don't know what we're doing for dinner. Let's see. We are currently here on the outskirts of Las Vegas. Hello, here I am. That was an incredibly slow zoom, wasn't it? So we're kind of gonna have like a late uh, road trip dinner. We're gonna find something here in the Las Vegas area. It's really hot out here. He says I'm on Damien and Benita right now. Yeah, I'm not even close. For some reason, my phone keeps telling me I'm near home. Come on, GPS. I'm trying to find some food here, Google. There's an Arby's open until 11. We can go through like a McDonald's or something. That's, that's easy. Yeah. Nice and easy. McDonald's it is. Road trip food. Unfortunately, eating right on the road is never, it's like, never. So, anytime I'm on the road, we try and, try and count how much bullshit I put in my system and it makes me work out more when I get home because then I gotta make up for all the bullshit that I ate. We'll call it for gains. Gains. We getting them gains. We gotta get all them, them carbs and proteins in. So we gotta eat a bunch of bullshit to get there. We made it to Utah, uh, still about four hours or so until, still about four hours worth of driving ahead of us. 
Just stop for a little bathroom break. Stretch our legs out a little bit. Hi, Bat. We're at the shops at Zion. It's fucking warm out here, though. I'm gonna tell you that. And we totally just lost an hour of our day. We're now in the mountain time zone, so it went from, we got here midnight our time. We crossed over into the state line, but then it jumped to 1 a.m., so that kind of fucked things up. We were trying to make it, Ashley's goal was to try and make it to the destination by 316. That probably would have would have been cool. Uh, then we were gonna try and make it by 420. That also would have been cool, especially because I got home at 420 earlier. It would have been exactly 12 hours. But now that like we didn't take into a, account like the hour change, it'll be sunrise about time we're getting in there. I really want to go for a run. I'm already tired of sitting in the car. Like I want to go running. I want to go run. <laughs> It is 5.20 a.m. here in the mountain time zone. We're close. We're about an hour away from Salt Lake City. We are currently in Payson, Utah. Here we are. That's the update. We got about one more hour to go. The sun's starting to rise. Sun's coming up on us. Now, I mean, this kind of concludes our 11 hour journey. We got this. One final hour. This is a very long drive. Incredibly long. Yeah, fuck yeah. So that is my sad excuse for a tired, sleepy time lapse of the sunrise. Really beautiful view here. We just got to our hotel. Nice, nice view. I'm gonna have to give you guys a tour in the morning. We are here in downtown Salt Lake City. Look how beautiful it is. Sun's coming up behind us. Everyone's tired. It took us about uh, 11, 12 hours, almost 12 hours I think with stops and everything like that. Beautiful, man, beautiful. I'm gonna catch a couple hours of sleep. Gotta charge everything back up. That's it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this uh, travel video to get here to Salt Lake City, the next video. Let's take a look at this town. But for now, that's it. It's bedtime for me. I will see you guys later.